Howdy folks, Zach Smith, Pest Dude, literally it is after sunset and I'm out and about uh, taking a look for a customer at a ground squirrel problem and coincidentally, this earlier today I shot a little video about ground squirrels and where they come from is a bigger part of the equation than how to get rid of them because they usually come by the hundreds and you only see a few at the forefront. So let me show you a little area right here. All right, so this is a little structure. This is very typical for ground squirrels as you start to see them getting under the foundation. And that's the beginnings of some real problems there because while it just looks like a little trench, actually they're getting under the structure and the concrete, believe it or not, will crack. So I have lots of examples of where concrete is completely failed from the ground squirrel damage. And it's so expensive to fix because you can't just put the dirt back underneath it. You have to tear the concrete out and put the compacted base rock back. And the squirrels are great at tearing out base rock. So anyway, check out the rest of the video. Um, if you have problems with ground squirrels, you do gotta consider how to get rid of a hundred of them, not two or three. Because if you can get rid of a hundred of them, you'll have a long-term solution. If you get rid of two or three, you'll be chipping away at it for a long time. All right, pest dude out. Howdy folks, Zach Smith, Pest Dude. We're out here today looking at a problem. And this is an interesting one about ground squirrels. So they burrow right at the fence edge because they want to get through the fence, but they can't fit through that opening. And so they burrow like crazy to try to get their itself in. So if the fence extends deeper under the ground or the fence even comes out under the ground this way, it will really thwart their efforts. And here's where the squirrels are coming from. And so you gotta really consider your ground squirrel problem. Where's the source? This is just a unimproved open field. So there's gonna be um, hundreds of them out here. And so if your property is being attacked by ground squirrels and your uh, neighboring property has this big old population, it's gonna be pretty hard to control ground squirrels uh, in a major way. You know, you're not gonna get total relief. You're gonna have to deal with uh, catching them one by one. And that makes people pretty crazy.